Unfortunately, TV today we have Tom Tresden. Tom, thanks for turning up today. No problem. Tom, you're currently playing for Enfield 1893 and yeah. what you played for Chesham. And give us a bit of insight into your football career. So I started out early age, uh, six, seven, playing youth football. And from, from an early age, I always wanted to progress, always looking to win games, try and be the best I could be. Um, started to progress early teens, so I was playing West Ham Advance football in their setup. Um, while I was playing for my local, I uh, probably joined Chesham at sort of that age, so come up through the youth system through them. Um, whilst at Chesham, I was playing high level of school football, we got to the National Cup semi-finals, um, joined the school's Hertfordshire Hull, County team, um, played for AFA County team as well, and then had a really successful season um, with with my youth team, under 17s, under 18s, um, picked up a lot of trophies. He was there at the presentation um, and offered me my first semi pro contract. And how did you feel about that opportunity when you got your first you know, semi pro contract at the age of what, 17? Yeah, it was a really good opportunity. I mean, always looking to progress, always wanting to be playing at my potential and that was a great opportunity that was provided to me through hard work and gained that and start started out just trying to build on my game and try and get the starts in the first team. Right. And then from that period of time obviously you were the first team player um, and then you started to come across a few injuries which was probably a bit frustrating for you. Yeah I was probably I'm probably one of the hard stories of semi pro football. Um, played a couple of seasons, one, one pre-season I tore my hamstring and from there uh, kept, kept going and uh, got frustrating for me. Um, took a gap away from football, started focusing on my career at the time, um, took a spell out travelling, decided I've, I've missed the football too much and wanted to get back involved. Uh, come back and it went again so you now it's just been about hard work um, building the strength building the strength in the hamstring again and hopefully now back fit and can get a run of games in before the end of the season very important and long term what's your long term goals what you're looking at obviously because you've got a nice career job at the minute obviously i can see why you'll see very, very sharp yeah, long, long term, keep playing football, keep striving forward, always wanting to win things, you know, semi-pro football's hard level, we're at step five, I think. Yeah, that's correct. Yeah. And, uh, you know, if opportunities come to play higher, of course I'll play higher, but at the moment, keep my head down, working hard, working hard outside of football as well, and s see what benefits um, I, I can gain from that. And what would you say is hard about non-league football from a semi-pro perspective? Because that's where you obviously you've mainly been playing semi-pro. So why would you say it's difficult? It's it's um it's a very difficult level of football to strive forward from there. Once you get to a certain age, you have to be on point all the time to get the scouts to get people looking at you to to go forward. And it's not always easy at a young age to. To be seen by a manager to get put in the team, it's a, obviously it's risky for the manager at a young age. You need to develop your skills, get more confidence in, and obviously the better you play, the more chances you're going to get. And if you keep working hard, the opportunities will come. Definitely. And what would your last message be before we go to all the youngsters out there trying to make it in the football world? I just say keep working hard, keep enjoying your football, which is the main thing. Um, and you can go as far as you want. You can be what you want to be as long as you put the effort in.